Hi friends, this is your Dr. B.P. alias Dr. Bapuji Pullepu. Now today we are going to discuss about the maximum minima function of two variables. Already you have studied in your school level, plus two level or intermediate first year or second year function of this is what maximum minima for the single variable. There what you will study, they will give dy y is equal to f of x then what you will do dy by dx you will first find out equative 0 you will get bunch of points x1 x2 x3 so many points you will get then what you will do you will do d square y by dx square then all points bringing and you will say that is what here x1 y1 x2 y2 so bunch of points you will get if you substitute it means what you will get here x1 y1 x2 y2 so many points one one point if you substitute means what suppose at what points d square by d square less than less means what the function attains reverse less means maximum greater than zero means what minimum minimum at this point this is not minimum how you will find out minimum taking this point if you substitute it, that is in your school level now what they will do they will give implicit function for f of x both functions they will give that is ordinary we deal with ordinary differentiation now we are going to discuss if they, if they will have f of x y they will give one function f of x then they will ask find the maximum minima for this function then maximum minima means what you will do first before that going to maximum means I want to tell one thing actually dou f by dou x you can call as a p notation partial differentiation then dou f by dou y is equal to q then dou square of by dou x square is equal to r dou square f dou x dou y is equal to s this is second order that is first order dou square f dou y square this we deal very deeply in partial differential equation that there i will discuss lot of things about pqrst function solving for partial differential equation eliminating the arbitrary constant functions we deal there that is different story here just time being you can remember pqrst if you know well and good taken for granted if you don't know which just you can keep in mind what is p what is q what is r what is s what is t now maximum minimum function of two variable means what they will give f of x y 0 now what you will do first you will find dou f by dou x equate to 0 find dou f by dou x then equate to 0 then dou f by dou y equate to 0 this is the first step actually from this you will get the bunch of points that is what x1 y1 x2 y2 so on you will get these points are called extreme points fx equate to 0 f y equal to 0 you will get the bunch of points for that solving also so many power types are there you don't worry timing can remember how to get x1 y1 means what from this then sometimes these two equations you will solve means you will get sometimes directly you will get sometimes x is equal to 0 means what taking this value I substituted a lot of stories there while doing the problem I will explain now time being okay the first step completed dou f by dou x and dou f by dou equate to 0 it is not equal to 0 you have to equate to 0 you will get the points that is called x1 y1 x2 y2 x3 y3 so on bunch of points you will get now in your hand bunch of points are there now what you will do the life of first step this is completed means what then you can find rt minus s square what is rt minus r that is why I told remember this who is r dou square f by dou x square dou square f by dou y square minus dou square f dou x dou y whole square prepare dou rt minus s square some function you will get some then what you will do once if you prepare the rt minus s square already in your hand bunch of points are there one by one point take and substituted here then I will discuss here different cases first case 1 I have a lot of points x1 y1 x2 y2 x3 y3 so many bunch of points in my hand one one point I will take I will ask him to go on their attack so first I will prepare rt minus s square then one point I will substitute it rt minus s square at x1 y1 
r x 2 y 2 x 3 y 3 x 4 so on. Suppose for what points I am getting r t minus s square greater than 0. r t minus s square is greater than 0. So, at this point function attains either maxima or minima. These are called actually extreme points. What points r t minus s square greater than 0 means what this is called stationary points. Stationary point means what my function attains maxima minima. You have so many stationary point at x1, y1 also you will have maximum, x2, y2 also you will have maximum, x3, v2, but maximum value is unique. This level I will get 10 means what in this point also I will get 10, there also I will get 10, there also I will get 1, but my maximum value 10 means what wherever I will go my maximum value 10, but position of this getting 10 is different. Here x1, y1 10 means what? Here x2, y2 10, here x3, y3 at 10. So, points may be vary, but value is unique value. Maximum value is unique, minimum value is unique, but different places I can get. If I fix this is function, this is the maximum one value means what? Wherever you can go, that is only maximum. If I able to get this is the minimum value means what? Wherever you can go, that is the minimum value. Reaching or not? So, taking all points I will substitute it. At what points suppose in I have one 10 points only 5 points only it satisfied. Means what? These points are called stationary points x1, y1, x2, y2. So, first gate will open when they will open when rt minus s square greater than 0 means what? Happy x1, y1, x2, y2 so on. Correct or not? Then <coughs> Once if you k okay, this is this is first this is what this is very very important if r t minus s square is greater than 0 means what now we can check the anyway the function attains either maxima or minima when its maximum means what you can check suppose one point at r t minus s square greater than means what dou square f dou x square you can check at x1 y1 suppose if it satisfies only come here this is greater than 0 means what this should be always true r t minus s square is greater than 0 means what and provided this does come is what function attains great means what reverse minimum correct or not suppose r t minus s square is greater than 0 this is what a this is what first case in a first then r t minus s square is greater than 0 this is always true then r t minus s square greater than 0 or you can check dou square f by dou x square or dou square f by dou y square both are same greater than 0 means function attain suppose r t minus s square 0 dou square f by dou x square less than 0 or maybe this is obviously that will also become less than 0 you do not worry less than 0 means what you let less means what maximum function attains max this is what this is not maximum value at x1 y1 I reach maximum what is my maximum is what f of x1 y1 is maximum correct or not this is what x at x1 y1 function attains minimum I will reach their minimum. What is my minimum value means what? Go back and substitute x1, y1 value. In function you will get minimum value. Reaching or not? So, first gate when it will open rt minus s square greater than 0 means what? Further you can go inside and you can search this. If they find the ask maximum minimum means what? First case is what? fx equal to 0, fy equal to 0. You will get a bunch of points. Then rt minus s square greater than 0 means happily first door will open then go inside then find dou square f by dou x already this you will find actually dou square f by dou x square this already you doing one by one without knowing this values you already know then you can substitute it getting or not this is the next second case reaching or not rt minus so what I am telling points are what extreme points then stationary points function at times either maxima minima for getting maxima is what rt minus s square is greater than 0 always is true. Next case, <coughs> once if rt minus s square greater than 0 means what? fxx is less means what? Great maximum, fxx great means what? Minimum, reverse greater minimum, lesser maximum provided this should be satisfies. Seeing this you do not tell. Next. <coughs> Suppose 
R T minus S square less than 0 at some points at x2, y2, so on. Some few points. The function is what? Neither maxima nor minima. This is called saddle points. Saddle point. Function attains neither maxima nor minima. Then this is case 2. Then case 3. R t minus s square is equal to 0. We can go for further investigation. That we do not know. So, now getting or not, they will go f of x y is equal to 0. Then f x equal to 0, f y equal to 0. You will get bunch of points x 1, y 1, x 2, y 2, so on. Then what you will do? Prepare r t minus s square greater than 0. Then only happily furtherly you can do. R t minus s square greater than 0 means what? f x x x greater than 0 means what? Function attains minimum at that point. R t minus s square greater than 0, f x x is less than 0 means what? Function attains maximum. Correct or not? Suppose R t minus s square less than 0 means what? Furly you do not want to do. You tell these points are saddle points, neither maximum nor minimum. Is equal to 0, so you do not want to tell. So, reaching or not? This is the first basic things actually. Any doubts? Okay. Thank you for watching this video. Bye.